This is Total Growth Investing, where price growth is not enough. Dividend growth is not enough. We want to find stocks that grow in both of these categories. And if we can find them, we can beat the market. This series of videos will be doing a basic review of the top stocks on my Total Growth Investing ranked watch list. I have 673 stocks on that list and I want to focus on the top 10. Please remember, I'm not a financial advisor. Nothing I say on this YouTube channel or anywhere else on social media should be seen as financial advice. This is my opinion and speculation based on my experience and my research. Please don't place trades based on the opinions of others. Base them on your strategy your, and base your trades on your own research and due diligence. Good luck. Let's talk about Heiko Corporation. Heiko began in 1957 as Heineke Instruments and began acquiring other companies in 1974. They haven't stopped. And they have now integrated 75 plus companies into their industrial conglomerate which with major contracts in aerospace, defense, and electronics. Their current name was taken in 1986. Their shares were listed on the New York Stock Exchange in 1999, but they have been paying dividends since 1993. In 2010, they were named on Forbes' Best 100 Small Companies. Market cap is just past 12 billion, so they're not really that small. Here's their website. They've got a really good picture of their history going back to the beginning. Listed on the New York Stock Exchange, 1999. Current sales way up there market cap 12 billion let's see surpasses 1 billion in sales in 2013 let's see what else the website has company profile they actually have two they have HEI and HEI.A operates in two segments, flight support and electronics technologies. If you fly on a plane, that plane probably has Heiko parts. Their customers. This doesn't include the list, but I have the list here. And like with many of the other stocks we've looked at, that list is long. If a company has airlines in its name, or air, it's probably a customer of Heiko. Their headquarters in Hollywood, Broward County, Florida. Since the beginning, they have not moved. First impressions. Their stock price is currently 107.02. It's a good affordable price. And then you look at their 10-year total returns. 1,125%. Are they a household name? In the aircraft supply and electronics industry, oh yes. Customers, we've looked at them. But there's another part of this. Subsidiaries. Remember I said they had absorbed 75 companies? They have 75 different companies doing business within Heiko. A lot of them are integrated, but if you see any of these, it's part of Heiko. And look at the locations. Connecticut, Indiana, the Netherlands, New York, Iowa, Florida, United Kingdom, Arizona, France, Germany, 
UAE, Singapore. They are really all over the place. Market cap, they're right now at $13.24 billion. Industrial sector, aerospace and defense. Here's their price chart going back 10 years. We'll look at this closer on Seeking Alpha, but they've been growing. They did have a crash, but they pretty much recovered. Dividend history and growth. I looked closely, and this is because a date shifted a week. We'll look at that in a little bit. Look at the growth. Over 15%, and over the last year, 33.59. They've been growing for 19 years. Their next dividend will pay on July 15th. Ex div date, June 30th in line with previous. Yield on cost going up over time, most of the time. And total return compared to the S&P, this is just five years. Let's look at 10 year on Seeking Alpha. Your total return, 10 years, 1,106. And over the max, well, if you'd bought it back in the early 90s, or when it IPO'd on the New York Stock Exchange in 99, you'd be doing pretty good. 19,658. This is a long-term hold. Let's see. Dividends. Currently paying 0 0.08. The dividend yield is really low, 0.14%. But look at the growth. And look at the payout ratio, 7.58. They have a lot of room that they could grow that dividend. So I mentioned this because of a date. Let's actually look at history because the actual history is solid with some specials. So they shifted things a little bit. They paid in January instead of December. So they just shifted things. But they've been paying steady. Let's see. Let's go to dividendstocks.cash. So I showed this to Torsten, and he really liked the stock, and he added it. Thank you, Torsten. Let's see. H E I. Heiko. It already has awards based on the history. Dividend Bunker, Dividend Sprinter, Earnings Rocket. So let's see. Earnings per share going up. Looks like they might take a dip, probably because of COVID but maybe something else is going on, but they do recover. Revenue and margins, pretty solid and pretty steady the whole time with revenue in yellow. Debt, steady growth, but that's also assets. Dividend yield, 
it's pretty low. 0.24. This is because the price has been going up fast. Fair value. We don't have a lot of history for adjusted price to earnings, so we'll leave that off. But other than that, they're a little overvalued right now. Let's look at that in more detail. So here's the price, and you can see how it's grown so fast. Let's bring in earnings per share. Adjusted, we only have data from October of 19. Let's leave that off. Operating cash flow. Dividends are nice. Here's the specials we saw. But again, the dividend's really low. Fair value based on earnings per share. And fair value based on cash flow. As you can see, they are, right now, pretty high value. Fair price is down here. And let's see. Let's adjust the calculations just for the last 10 years. Does that affect things? No. So if we bought it here, right now, we might have a loss. We don't want that. This is why I think Heiko is a little overvalued right now. It's not time to buy this stock. But it's certainly one to keep an eye on. Because with this kind of growth, once the world gets back to speed, I think it's going to grow again. And you can see that. This only goes out two years. It's been around since 1957. It's going to be around for a lot longer. Is this a buy for you? Let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching. If you liked this video, please click the like button and subscribe to the channel. I'll be doing more reviews like this of my top ranked total growth stocks over the next few weeks. And I also have some guests planned with other ideas that you can use to beat the market over the long term.